My name is Allie Linfoot. I am 47 years old. I work for Clackamas County as a peer services coordinator. And my story starts when I was 12. Um, I remember almost the exact moment when the switch flipped inside of me and things just looked different. They sounded different, they smelled different, everything was just different. Um, I think I was very lucky though because at that time they didn't diagnose children with bipolar disorder. It was not a children's illness, it was an adult illness. And I think that that is probably what saved my life, along with my family. Um, so my family never heard, your daughter will never do this. She'll never go to college. She'll never hold a job. She'll never get married. She shouldn't have children. You know, all of those things. They never heard those things. Um, and so the expectations for me never changed. I was told that, yes, you will graduate from high school. You will go to college. You'll get married and you'll have children and you're going to be happy. <laughs> so that's what I did. And it truly is what I did. And um, it wasn't until my 20s that I was officially diagnosed. Um, and the diagnosis actually came with uh, having a child who we knew was struggling. And um, at age four, uh, he received a diagnosis. And um, my husband and I, while filling out, filling out all the paperwork to all of the family history and everything. And I thought, oh, my husband, they are going to look at you and say, now we know where it comes from. And actually, it was the complete opposite. <laughs> they looked at my paperwork and said, you know, it might be a good idea if you got an assessment also, um, which I did. At that point, I was so willing to do anything I could to help my son. Um, and that's when I received my diagnosis. Um, and it was through the support of family, friends, my husband, um, that everything turned out okay. Everything turned out okay. It doesn't mean it's been perfect. There have been struggles. Um, I've been depressed. I'm primarily manic. That's been my biggest problem. But there are so many gifts that come with that too, um, which has helped me accomplish all that I have in my life. Um, and now I have three children who are adults, one who's 11, and they have taught me so much. The people I meet in my work teach me so much, and that is part of me maintaining recovery, maintaining recovery without medications, um, and it is knowing that every person I talk to, I'm going to learn something, and I'm going to grow from that, and it keeps me just wanting more, and that is how I stay happy.